Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Brockville Memorial Center. I'm your host, Franklin Richards, and I'll be doing play-by-play -play for this afternoon's game between the Brockville Ballistic and the Kingston Kings. Here we go with the opening face-off. And number two, Paul Bavitas, takes it off the court. Bavitas takes it over to the side. Looking for a little bit of open space. Passes it over to number seven, Jay Walker, the assistant captain. Shot clock's going down seven seconds. And they're just going to shoot it wide. And the shot clock runs out. Number 16. Nope, I'm sorry. That was number 18. Or the Brockville Ballistic. Robbie Sullivan. Now number... We see some numbers here that we do not see on the sheet here. Kingston now has possession and starts going down the court. That's the center line. Is number 10, Alec Johnson. Takes a shot, and the shot clock is rewound, and here comes Brockville. Little tender passes it out to number 14, Ryan Grimes. Ryan passes it down the court to number 16, Tristan Thompson. And Kingston takes it back. Kingston down on a breakaway. Stopped by the Brockville defense. Brockville passes it down. Takes a shot. And stopped by the Kingston goaltender, David Joseph. Brockville gets it back, though. Brockville takes a shot to reset the shot clock, and it goes all the way down the court. Brockville's goaltender for today, Colin Halliday, comes out to play it. And that is to number 10, Jake Fawcett, who is another assistant captain. Kingston's number 12, Steven Richardson takes it down, and it looks like Brockville will gain possession of the ball as it goes out of play. Rockville takes it down the court with number 15, Shannon Hill. Or no, I'm sorry, number 16, Tristan Thompson. And Brockville gains possession behind the Kingston behind the Kingston goal. Brockville still fighting for position here. And a hot off the bench is number 25, Travis Galloway. Travis keeping possession of the ball, trying to cross it out in front, and Alyssa take it back. And Kingston now takes away with it. Kingston's number 14, Kyle, Kyle Aylesworth, takes it down and passes it to number 7, Jay Waller. Jay takes a shot and it goes wide as Brockville picks it up. And it was intercepted. Kingston's number 2, Cole Bavitas, fighting to try and keep it alive for Kingston here. Doing a really good job. Tries to take a shot, but it's deflected. Number seven for Kingston shoots. And the one that took the shot was Jay Waller. Number 20 for Kingston takes it down now. Doug Udding, who is the captain of the Bronco Ballistics. Walks in, shoots. Saved by David Joseph.
Number 10 for Kingston. Alec Johnson takes it down now. Alec fighting for him. Trying to get through some Brockville players here. Alec walks in, shoots, and it goes wide. Number 7, Jay Waller now pinned up against the boards. But fights loose. Oh, the goaltender takes him. Jay takes the shot. And it went wide. Close chance for Casey there, but Rockville's goaltender Colin Halliday had that. The captain now passes it off to number. I cannot see the number yet. Number 25. Travis Galloway. Travis still has the ball. Being strongly defended here. And the shot clock goes off. So Kingston now takes possession. Kingston's number 21. David Moraski takes it down the ice. Or the floor, I'm sorry. Passes it off to number eight, Jake Evoy. Jake takes the shot, and it goes just wide. Passes it back to Brockville's goaltender, Colin Halliday. And Colin just launches it down the field. Number 10 for Brockville, Jake Fawcett takes it down the court. And it's over to the captain, Doug Udding. Doug fighting off Kingston defense here to try and get through to get a shot. And he does so. Kingston up for a break. Number 23. Which is Parker Wilcox, which is the captain for the Kings. Has it inside. And got loose and is now controlled by number 14, Kyle Aylesworth. Kyle. Fighting hard to keep in possession for his team. The pass out was aimed for the captain, Parker Wilcox, but was misfired, and the shot clock has gone off. Referee is just waiting. And here we go. Rockville back out now. Doing well to keep off the defense. Doing well. Oh, there was a little bit of a collision between teammates there. It's number 14, Ryan Grimes pinned up against the boards as it comes loose. And the shot clock goes off. Number 22, Davy Smith. Launches it down to number 10, Alec Johnson. Way over to number 14, Kyle Aylesworth. And Kingston scores! It was a nice play by Kingston, and the goal was finally scored. By number 10, Alec Johnson. So here we go with the faceoff between number 19, Todd Fawcett, and Doug. Or no, I apologize. Davy Smith. Number two now, Cole Levitas. Oh, gets cross-checked from behind and there was no call there. Again, lacrosse is a very rough sport, and it is very hard to get a call in this kind of sport. Rockville has a break now. And the captain, Doug Utting, has it. He did, but he has now switched off. And coming on now. With possession is number 
was number nine. Oh. Indeed, number 19, Todd Fawcett. And Todd's lost, Todd has lost possession. Number 23, the Kingston has a break. The captain, Parker Wilcox, takes a shot. And it stops. Oh. Broncos having a hard time getting it out of their own zone. And Kingston gains possession. Here we go for number 10. Alec Johnson, who was the goal scorer of the last goal scored by Kingston. Johnson fighting through. Passing it off. Number 18, Robbie Sullivan. Alec Johnson takes a shot. And it was stopped. Kingston fighting very hard here. Oh, nice play. Johnson's right in the middle of everything. And Kingston again gains possession. Number nine, Zach Masterson. Kingston again gains possession. Takes a shot, and it's stopped by the goaltender. Colin Halliday is just holding on to it now and passes it off. Kingston takes that pass, and the ball is loose. Kingston's number nine, Zach Masterson, takes possession. Passes it off to number 14, Kyle Aylesworth, who passes that off to number seven, Jay Waller, the assistant captain. Jay. Walking in, takes a shot and it goes wide. So Kingston's shot clock has run out. And here comes Brockto. Brockto pushing hard. And nice defense by the Kingston Kings. Oh! And Brockville will now get possession due to the cross check against the boards. Kingston's defense fighting hard for that ball. And gets possession. And number two, Polbavitis runs out. Pole passes it to Jay Waller. And there's a player down on the field. I believe it's number 22, Danny Smith. We don't have a replay here, mach machine here, so we can't take a look at that. But we'll definitely try to know the problem as soon as possible with Danny. He looks down. Again, ladies and gentlemen, when you take an injury in the cross, it's not just something subtle. It is something very serious. So we will try and keep up with Danny and let you know how he's doing as he's now getting up. Teams and fans cheering him on here as he walks slowly off the field. Here we go. All right. Well, Brockville gains possession and passes it down the field, out into the King's zone. Brockville having a hard time trying to take a shot here. Getting set up. Captain Doug Utting. Captain gets knocked down. Passes it out in front. Teammates trying to figure out what's going on, and Jake Fawcett takes the shot. And 
Ryan Pinkston gets possession here. And they're off. Davidez passes it off to... Well, we cannot see the number right now. And takes a shot and it goes wide. Here comes number 25, Travis Galloway, fighting for possession. And number 10, Jake Fawcett takes the shot, it stops. Kingston comes up, number 21, David Moraski. Moraski passes it off to number 9, Zach Matheson. Masterson and Harden. Rockwell gains possession as Kingston kind of was running out of time on the shot clock now. And Kingston fighting hard to keep Rockwell's time down. Rockville takes a shot. Rebound. Stopped by Kingston's goaltender, David Joseph. Rockville now. Still in the Kingston zone. Passes it off to number 23, Parker Wilcox who then passes it out to number nine, Zach Masterson. Masterson fighting hard to get it in there. Off now to Parker Wilcox. Wilcox fighting hard, shoots! And it just went wide. Now off to Mark Couture, over. And Brockville picks up the loose ball. Rockville is having a hard time, one, getting an, oh, nice pickup. Kingston takes the shot. That was number nine, Zach Masterson, who stole that. Inside of the goaltender's crease, and the goaltender quickly passes it off. And that is the captain, Doug Udding. Doug fighting hard, and loses possession. Logan Ross now, passing it off to Paul Davidis. Davidis over to number 23, the captain, Parker Wilcox, who shoots, passes it off. Off to number 21, David Moraski, who takes a shot. Up and out of play. Houston now gains possession. That was number 14 with the shot, Kyle Aylesworth. Brockville now has possession. Nice a loose ball. Nope, Brockville gets it back to number three. Ben Harkness over to number 10, Jake Fawcett. Fawcett still with the ball. Goes outside and passes it off. Brockville takes a shot. And it's in the net. That was scored by number five, Devin Primo. That was definitely a great play by Jake Fawcett to wait it out and walks right out in front for Devin Primo, who just rips one past Joseph. Four oh eight left to go in the first quarter here. Shots are 12 to nine in favor of Kingston. Kingston takes it up. Over to Wilcox, right in front. 
That was Cole Bavitas with the shot. And here comes the captain for the Brock Football Ballistic, Doug Udding. Doug walking right in. Takes a shot. And it looks like Brocko will gain possession once again. Or no. We have a penalty going on here. To Kingston's number 25, Logan Ross. I believe it is two minutes for hooking as I saw from the referee here. And we will find out once the announcer gives the official call. Having a little bit of clock issues here. And it seems like we're ready to go here. So here we go with Brockville. Uh, the first power play of the game. Brockville passing it along nicely. Takes a shot. Up. Oh, and looks like we have a potential break, but oh, it looks like we do. And Kingston has possession shorthanded, and he just keeps possession inside of the Brockville zone, killing off time of their power play. And he is doing a fabulous job, and that was number 10, Alec Johnson, killing off that. Now off to number 23, the captain. And now back to Alec Johnson. Johnson's having a great game so far here in the first quarter. Oh, Johnson gets pinned up against the boards. Johnson still with the ball. Johnson is doing a fabulous job. Fans not happy that they did not get a call. Oh, maybe they did. We are about to find out here. And indeed, there is going to be a penalty for Brockville to number 10, Jake Fawcett. I believe it's two minutes for holding. Again, we will have to wait for the official call. So it is going to be a little bit of four on four action. That's number seven, Jake w Jay Waller. Off to number 23, Captain Patrick Wilcox. Peter Parker Wilcox, my apologies. Brock will get, oh, and the shot clock goes off. That is the captain, number 20, Doug Utting, taking it down. Doug still has, has possession of it. Kingston whacking away, trying to get the ball. Doug holding on. Doug walks right in and doesn't decide to shoot it. And that is because Kingston now has the man advantage. Brockville tried for the outlet pass, didn't quite work, and now here comes Kingston. Kingston. Picking it up is number two, Cole Bavitas. Now number 10, Alec Johnson takes a shot and it goes wide. Rockwell taking it down shorthanded right in the middle, shoots. Nice save by David Joseph. Here come the Kings now. Still have a minute advantage for about 15 seconds. Number 14, Kyle Aylesworth. Just holds on to it. Walks right in, shoots! Save. Jay Waller picks it up now and passes it off. 
Peter Wilcox takes it now. Right in front, shoots! And nice save off a shot by Kyle Aylesworth. Halliday off to Fawcett way down the field for Tristan Thompson up to Doug Fawcett I believe indeed it is Fawcett takes a shot blocked over And it Rockville will gain possession inside the King's zone. Rockville fighting hard. Going on the outside. Shooting. Oh, and it just goes wide. Rockville now fighting hard now. And that's the end of the first quarter. The score is all tied up here between Brockville and Kingston at one apiece. Shots in favor of Kingston, 15 to 11. We'll be back in 10 minutes for the second quarter. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back for the second period of the lacrosse game between the Brockville Ballistic and Kingston Kings. I was informed that we are not doing quarters this afternoon. Instead, we are doing periods. And here we go with number two, Cole Bovitas for Kingston Kings. Cole. Pass it off and does. No, my apologies, it was missed. Out in front, number 14. Kyle Ellsworth takes a shot, and it was stopped. Jake Fawcett, Rockwell passes it off. I believe that is number 16, Tristan Thompson now. He passed it off to... Ben Harkness. Shot by Rocco. And it's stopped. And Kingston looking for a break there for a pass for, I believe, the captain, Parker Wol Wolcott. Indeed, it was Parker Wolcott with the break. Kingston gets it back now for Cole Levitas. Cole walks down the field and passes it off to number one. Jake Evoy. And now it's down in the corner for Zach Masterson. Pass back to Zach Masterson now. Zach. Over to Evoy. Back to Zach. Zach walks in, looking for some sort of setup here. Nice to watch the clock. Zach takes a shot. And it goes out of play. Rockville now taking it up the field is the captain number 20, Doug Udding. Doug passes it off. Well, Jarrett Pitt, who passes it off to number 10, Jake Foster. Rockville still has possession now. Jarrett Pitt. Trying to get inside the Kingston zone and does by passing it off to number 10, Jake Fawcett. And there was a shot in goal. Walked right in, takes the shot, and there we go. Inside the net it goes. And it was number 
12. Jarrett hit with the goal to give Brockville the 2-1 lead. The shots on goal are about even, but are slightly in favor for Kingston at 17-6, with 17.02 left to go in the second period. Here we go with the face-off now. walking right in, shot, and that goes wide. Rockville's captain, Doug Fawcett, now inside of the Kingston zone, all by himself. Doug trying to get inside, and cannot because he is stopped by number 19, Mark Couture. Rockville, though, gains possession back. Doug Fawcett passes, and Doug Hudding, I'm sorry, passes it off. Now off to Jake Fawcett. Jake still has possession of it. And he makes it 10 seconds on the shot clock, takes a shot. And there's the rebound. Jake tries to pick it up. It's a mad scramble in front of the goaltender. And Brockville gets possession. Takes a shot. And Jake Fawcett picks up the rebound. Over the captain, Doug Hutting here. Doug walks right in. Goes for the pass here. And he takes a shot. And it stops. Jared Pitt now. Pitt now. Fighting his time now. Figuring out what he figuring out what he has to do. Tries to go for a pass for Jake Foster right in front of the goaltender and that shot went wide. Kingston's number 19. Mark Couture walks right in now. Mark walking right in. Out in front, and Couture grabs it back. Couture buying his time. Couture walks right in, shoots! Stopped by the Brock Row goaltender. It's now Cole Levitas now. Out in front for David Morask. Morask. Sorry, man. Morasky picks it up, passes it out to number 14, Kyle Aylesworth, who just takes a wild shot as the shot clock runs out. Number 33, Cole Jackson, passes it off to number Five, Devin Primo. Devin walks in, shoots, and he scores! Devin Primo with a fantastic goal gives Brockville a 3 to 1 lead. A two goal lead in the second period for Brockville as Brockville now also has the lead in the shot total, 21 to 18. 13 minutes and 42 seconds left to go here in the second period. Brockville three, Kingston one. Kingston gets back now for number 10, Alec Johnson. Alec walking right in. Trying to get something set up here. Right out in front for number 14, Kyle Aylesworth, who just takes the back shot. And here comes Brockville again. Here comes the captain, Doug Udding. Takes a shot, and it goes off the post and wide. Cole Bavitas now gets knocked down. 
And it seems like there will be a call of some sort. And it's going to go to Brock Bills. We do not know who it was. We apologize for that. We believe it was because of the mad scrum for the ball. That's all we can really tell you about that one. Kingston now on the power play as Alex Johnson goes back to pick it up. Johnson. Fighting this time. A good passing game here for Kingston now. Takes a shot. Score! That was number nine, Zach Masterson, with that goal. Nice goal by Masterson, just walked right out in front, sniped her right home. Well, less than a minute later, it is now three to two for Brockville. And here we go with the face off. Between Jay Waller and Todd Fawcett. Jay wins that one. Patrick Wolf. Patrick Wolf has to stick it in. Shoots. And that goes wide. Oh, we have a player down on the field now. Looks like he's all right. And that was number... 19, I believe, Mark Couture. Yes, it was. Must have been a hack to the leg or something along those lines. Just a, well, like I said, nothing's really minor in the cross, but to be on the legs the one spot where you really, really don't want to get hit. Brock has possession now. Rockville looking for a penalty on that head shot, but they're not going to get one. Rockville. Over to the captain, Doug Udding. Doug, riding his time. Doesn't have that much time, nothing checking until the shot clock shoots. Stopped by the goaltender. Kingston, looking for a big dump here, but it goes right to the Rockville's goaltender, Holland Holiday. Rockville takes it right back into the zone. That was number 10, Jake Fawcett passing it off and receiving it back. Fawcett walking right in, shoots! Stopped by goaltender David Joseph. Doug Utting now. Over to Fawcett. Nope, Utting still has it. And that goes off a player into the screen. So here comes Cole for Venus. I'd like to apologize, I am pronouncing Cole's name wrong, it is Cole DeVelds, not Bevitas. That's what I was told at the beginning, but it, we have now received confirmation that it is Bevelds. Rockville now. And it seems like there will be a call for high sticking on number sixteen, Tristan Thompson. So Kingston will get possession inside the Brockville zone. Nope, we're actually we're gonna start out in the center of the court, and here we go. Over to Aylesworth. Nice passing game going on over to Aylesworth now. 
passes it off. Nice little passing game going on here. Kingston with a shot! Stopped by Kingston. There's Rockwell's goaltender. Kingston gets possession again. Oh, nice cross pass. That was deflected out of the air. Oh! And Kingston's player gets knocked down. And Kingston still has possession inside the Brockville zone. Kingston lining up. Back to Johnson. Johnson with a shot! Saved by the goaltender, Colin Halliday. Zach Masterson now. Zach walking in. Shoots! Save. Masterson picks it right back up again, though. And fumbles it to Brockville. Doug Udding now. Walking right in. Well, the two captains, Wilcox and Udding, going at it now. And Udding falls over. Or gets knocked over, I'm sorry. Brockville right on front, shoots! Nice save by the Kings goaltender. Brockville doing a great job now. Devin Primo. Over to number... Well, we cannot see now because he's being pinned up against the boards by two. One is Cole Davidas. And he comes out strong. Shoots! Nope. They're saying they should check the Brockville's player's stick because they believe it's an illegal stick because that is twice now it's been stuck inside of it. Referee's discussing now. Trying to figure out what to do. Devin Primo. Over Doug Cutting, I believe. And Kingston grabs it back. Masterson. Passing game now inside of the zone. And Masterson picks up the ball. Masterson winds up, fakes, winds up again, shoots! Saved by the Brockville goaltender. Masterson doing a nice defensive job for Kingston now as Brockville starts out of their own zone. And that is to number 16, Tristan Thompson. Thompson walking in, shooting. Six scores! Off the rebound. That was number 10, the assistant captain, Jake Fawcett. And that now gives Brockville back their two-goal lead. The score is now 42 in favor of Brockville. Shots on goal are 27-22 for Brockville with 7.47 left to go in the second period. Pass, walks in, fakes again, shoots, and that goes out of play. Off the Brockville goaltender. Kingston now. Wilcox tries to walk in now. Off to Jay Waller. Waller. Looking for something to do, Waller. Still being blocked here. Over to Aylesworth. Aylesworth with the shot, and it goes. And Kingston gets it back off the rebound. 
Rockville. And there you go. And that is David Muraski. Now, David walking in. Oh, no. Okay, and here comes Brockville. That is the captain. Passing it off to Devin Primo. Primo walking in. Primo shooting. Stop. Brockville picks up the rebound. Brockville wants and shoots. That goes well. He dies to try and stop the ball now. Number 25 is Logan Rose. And that gets knocked out of his stick. Rockville tries to pass it down and does. Over to number 16, Tristan Thompson. Tristan with the shot. Picked up by Brockville again. Tristan, over. The Bells now. Pull the Bells. Walks right in. Passes. And that slips away. And that is Doug Utting now. Doug now. Patiently waiting now. Ten seconds on the clock. Takes the shot. Stopped by the goaltender. And Kingston picks up the rebound. Over to Cole Bevelt. Up in front for a breakaway. And that is scored by number 10, Alec Johnson, on the breakaway. Good passing play started that one up for Kingston, and it is now 4-3 for Brockville. Nice breakaway goal by Johnson as it was passed off by Cole Bevelt. So here we go now. And Kingston wins it right back. Number seven, Jay Waller. Again, trying to just make something happen here. Kingston definitely with the momentum right now. The belt picks it up. The belt. It's over. Over to number 19. Mark Couture. Who is back out now? That was the captain, Peter Wilcox, just taking a random shot as the shot clock was running out of time. Here comes the captain now for Brockville, Doug Udding. Doug. Waiting. Walks right in front. Shoots. And he scores! So the middle of the field was wide open for Doug Udding. And he definitely takes advantage of that chance. It is now 5-3 for Brockville. 3.57 left to go here in the second period. Shots in favor of Rockville now, 31 to 25. And Kingston gains possession from that. As Jay Waller picks it up and takes it down the court. Jay Waller now, getting set up here. Passing it off, trying to get it to the Belds. That didn't work. Oh, that was... There's a penalty coming up here to Brockville now. And here comes the penalty to Brockville. Power play here. Let us 
Jay Waller. Waller stocks up, waits, passes it off to Alec Johnson. Johnson over now. Johnson. That was off to Aylesworth. And that takes a shot. back on the offense. That's Aylesworth. Wolcock trying to get it in. Here comes Brockville on a potential break, and it is. He comes in, shoots. Oh. Defenseman ran over their own goaltender. So now we are waiting. Like Joseph's okay, and we'll continue on. Just had to fix the net up. So a minute 48 left to go in the second period. 20 seconds left to go in the power play. And that was the captain, Peter Wilcox, who I believe was just as shocked as everybody else was. So it is now 5-4. Brockville, and ladies and gentlemen, this has become one very entertaining game. Here we go with the face off now, and Brockville takes that. To, no, Kingston takes it back. Jay Waller. Brockville gets possession and passes it off. And Kingston playing great defense right now. That is number 12. Jarrett Pitt. Pitt. Lighting some time. Pitt. Devin Primo. With the great pass from Jarrett Pitt, Devin Primo fires one home. And Brockville has regained their two goal lead. It is now six to four for Brockville. Shots on goal right now, 32-28 in favor of Brockville. And we have 58.4 seconds left to go here in the second period. So just like that, Brockville has regained their two goal lead. And here we go. Passes it off. 
Kiki Woka. No, I'm sorry, that was not Peter Woka, that was Jay Waller, assistant captain. Here comes Waller. Waller just takes a shot to get the shot clock off. shot and that goes off the goaltender. Two seconds left to go here in the second period and as Kingston regains possession that will just about do it for the second period. The score after two periods is six to four in favor of Brockville. Shots on goal still 38, 32 to 28. We'll be back in about 10 minutes for the third and final period. Stick around. Back, ladies and gentlemen, for the start of the third period. And Brockville gains possession after the opening faceoff. It's Dustin McElroy. Dustin. Nice stop. There's a shot from Brockville. And a stop by the Kingston Bolton. And here comes Peter Wilcox. Possibly going for. Oh. And Brocko goaltender scoops that up. And there's an interception by Rose. Rose. Passes it off to Johnson. Johnson. Walks right in. And here comes Doug Utting, captain. He goes for a pass, which is just like, oh, wow. There was a hit from behind. No call on the play. But Kingston does gain possession. And here comes David Muraski. Off to number nine. That was Zach Masterson. And the shot clock runs out, and Brocko gains possession. And here comes number. Twenty-five. That was number twenty-five, Travis Galloway, and now here's number ten, Jake Fawcett. Fawcett being pressed up against the boards there, and here comes Kingston. This is number twenty-one, Moraski shoots, and that goes way up and out of play. Here comes Brockville now. Coming down. Out of their own zone into the center field area. Running passes it off to number 25, Travis Galloway. Galloway. Waiting. Out in front! And that was Ian A. Oh. That was close, but thanks to the defensive of uh, Kingston, there was no goal. Here comes Kingston on the offense, number 10. Alec Johnson with the shot. Rockville aiming for a break there, didn't quite get it. As Doug Utting now, Utting. Now center field, up into their own zone. Utting spinning, shoots, and he scores! Utting from his own zone, spins, deeps, 
and then finishes it off to give Rockville a three goal lead. The score is now 7-4 in favor of Rockville. And here we go with the face off. Kingston, nope. We don't know who has it. Brockville gains possession. Crawford walks in. Shoots. And that went wide. Over to Cole Bavell. Bavell shoots. And he scores! We do believe that was Cole Bavell's there. Indeed it was. As Kingston is now back in this. 7-5 to five in favor of Brockville. Rockville gains possession. Rockville spinning, Deacon shoots, and he scores! And again, spinning, Deacon, and scoring was the captain, Doug Hunting. Here you go, Homer! The score is eight to five for Brockville now. Shots on go. goal, 36 to 30. And here comes Brockville again. Number 19, Todd Fawcett. Nice save. Off the shot by number five, Devin Primo. Casey Walker shoots. And that's a goal for, I believe it was number 14, Kyle Aylesworth. After a pass by the captain, Peter Wilcox. We will see here momentarily. And indeed it was Kyle Aylesworth up a pass from Peter Wilcox. And the scoring continues. Eight to six now for Brockville. And Kingston right off the bat gets possession again. That is Cole Beveld now. Beveld over to Zach Masterson. Masterson still has possession now. Masterson behind the net. And the shot clock runs out. Now, Rockville out of their own zone. Stops up, waits. I believe that's number 10, Jake Fawcett. Fawcett walks right in, shoots! Save. Barely, oh. And Fawcett I, picks up the rebound. And again, he stopped by the goaltender, David Joseph. And I'm sorry, that was not Fawcett. In fact, it was Jarrett Pitt. Pitt now, off to number 25, Travis Galloway. Over to the captain, Doug Utting. Utting. Over now, shoots. That was Jarrett Pitt. 
the shot. Here we go. And that's Doug Utting now. Utting shoots. And off the blocker and just wide. Peter Wilcox now. Wilcox. And again, stops by Colin. Johnson now. Goes for a pass. Rockville now. Number 10, Fawcett. Back to Fawcett. Fawcett walks in, shoots. All right, and now Kingston has possession of the ball. And here comes Jay Waller. Waller now. Coming up the court, Waller. Trying to get past Brockville defense. Waller, walking right, no, doesn't walk right in. Passes it off and he shoots. Kingston picks up the rebound and that's number eight, Jake Eboy. Sorry, it is not Jake Evoy. In fact, it is Jake Evy. We apologize. Here, goes the, here comes Brockville now. And that is number 14, Ryan Grimes going off for Brockville, so Kingston will have a two minute power play and they are down eight to six. Shots on goal 39-34 for Brockville and here we go. Johnson. That's the dog back to Johnson. Back to Masterson. Back to Johnson. He shoots. That's a stop. And Halliday picks it up. Number 10, Johnson. Johnson passes it off. And he shoots. Over to Masterson. Masterson. Over to Johnson. Johnson shoots. That went just wide. Brockville just dumps it down the field and Cole Bevels picks it up. Over to Johnson. Johnson looks back waiting for his partner. Johnson. Over. Walks in. Shoots. And here comes Brockville down the field. And that was Parker Wolcock stealing it from Utting. Fans screaming that Utting's helmet was undone. Good penalty kill here for Brockville. And Brockville now gets possession. Seven seconds left to go in the penalty kill for Brockville. We are waiting at this point. Something needs 
to be mopped up. We have a fair sized crowd here today at the Brockville Memorial Center for this afternoon's game. It is definitely a good one, both offensive and defensive pressures applied by both teams. Shots are pretty much even at 39 37 in favor of Brockville. The score, however, is a little, little on Brockville's side right now. It is 8 to 6. But as every lacrosse fan knows, a game is not over until the final buzzer sounds. Anything, and I mean anything, can happen. We're halfway through the first period, just, o uh, just a little bit over the first half of the first period, uh, with 9.50 left to go here in the third period, my apologies. And it looks like we're about ready to get going here again, so here we go. Brock, Bill Kennel and off, and they've done it. Off to Cole Bevelds now. Bevelds. Walks right down the middle of the court and into the Brockville zone. Bevelds again. Looking for help. And Jake Evie. Evie gives it there. Evie now. Ready to go now as he passes it off. And that is number 18, Dustin McElroy. McElroy. Over. He shoots. And that is a good save by the goaltender. Rock closes it up behind the net. He spins to a boy. And the whistle was blown. And Kingston now gets possession. And here comes the captain, Parker Wolcox. And that was Masterson who just missed the pass from Wolcox. Masterson has to run in and take the shot because the shot clock's almost out. And that was number 14, Kyle Ellsworth, with the shot. Seems like there's going to be another Brockville penalty. Kingston's gonna go on the power play for two minutes. The shots are dead even right now at 39 apiece. Score still eight to six in favor of Brockville. That's number 10, Alec Johnson. Johnson walks right in, passes it off. And that was a good save by Colin Halliday. And here's number 12, Jarrett Pitt. Pitt killing off time. Pitt walks right in between two defenders, walks in, shoots. Nice save by Joseph. Pitt, keeping control there in the zone. Pitt. Man's looking for a penalty and they're gonna get it.
fans calling for a four minute penalty for a cross check. And indeed they're gonna get it. It's a four minute cross checking penalty. Comes Kingston now. Five on three. Get on him, Jay. Get him right there. Come on, guys. Get on him. Here we go. There's the captain, Doug Utting, there for Rocco. Doug walking right in. Doug killing off time here. Off the penalty kill. Doug. Utting doing a great job here. Utting's now getting swarmed. The numbers game catching up to him now. That's it. Come on. And here comes another penalty to Brockville. Not something they need right now in this game as they already have a four minute penalty and they're gonna get another one here. Here comes Kingston. Kingston's got an extra man on the floor because the goaltender has been out of the net and now they have a six on the floor advantage. Shoots! And that's gonna do it. And here we go, another five on three for two minutes. 5.31 left to go in the third period. The score is eight to six for Brockville, but Brockville now has to go five on three for two minutes. Shots on goal, Kingston has pulled ahead once again with the 41-40 shot total lead. And here we go. Kingston has a lot of time to work with here. Johnson walks right in, passes it off. Walks in, passes it over. That was to Jay Waller. Waller just missed that. That's Matheson now. Matheson. Welcome Jay Waller. No. Back to Matheson. Over to Waller. Back to Matheson. Matheson walks in, shoots. And that goes just wide. Joseph. Matheson it off to Johnson. Johnson with a long shot and the both under shot and here comes Brockville. Here comes Brockville. Stay with him! Stay with him! Stay with him! Put him And here comes number nine, Zach Matheson on a break. And Halliday stops that. Matheson again shoots. Halliday stops that too. Brockville doing very well on the five on three penalty kill here. Here comes Brockville. Pinned up against the boards now as Kingston tries to get possession back. And that penalty killer was Devin Primo doing a fantastic job to kill it off for Brockville. 24 seconds left to go on the five on three. And here it comes. That's number 10, Alec Johnson. Over to number 14, Kyle Ailes, or number 19, I apologize, Mark Couture. Here comes Brockville. Brockville on the penalty kill. Over. And they've done it. Brockville has killed off the five on three. Now they just gotta kill off 35 seconds left to go in the four minute cross checking penalty. Here comes Kingston though, here's Wilcox. Passes it off and that's a save. Here comes Brockville. Still has to kiss, kill off 20, 20 seconds. See if they can do it. And it looks like they will be able to. Joseph picks it up and passes it off to number 14, Kyle Aylesworth. Aylesworth, over to the captain, Peter Wilcox. Wilcox up, takes a shot, save. Rebound, out there. Behind you! 
And here comes Bronco, and he drops it. But he gets it back. Here we go. Break away. He scores! That's number 12, Jarrett Pitt. After killing off six minutes of penalty time, Rockville comes back and scores to give them a nine to six lead. Two and a half minutes to go in the third period. Shots, 46, 41 for Kingston. And here we go. Richardson. Over to Bevels. Bevels. Over to number 19, Mark Couture. Couture walking in. Couture looking for a little bit of open space. Can't find it. Couture now. Taking a shot just to reset the clock. And here comes Brockville. And that's the captain, Doug Utting, who has it knocked out of his stick. And here comes Bevelds now. And here comes Parker. Parker Wilcox now. Wilcox passes it off. No, he did, fakes it. Now passes it off. He passes it to number nine, Zach Matheson. Matheson walking in off a of Brockville defender and way up. And still in play. And there's going to be, there was a whistle blown. And it looks like there's going to be a timeout called now. With 1.09 left to go in the third period, the score is 9 to 6 in favor of Rockville. Kingston, however, has a favor of shots with 47 41. And then that's the signal to let the teams know their timeout has finished. This will come right down to the wire, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go. Rockville now. Picking it up, and that's the captain, Doug Utting. Spinning, deeping, doing what he has to do to avoid. There was a very long pass there. Rockville regains possession. Right out in front. Rockville trying to scoop up the loose ball, and does. Rockville now. Thirty seconds left to go, and possession goes to Brockville. Looks like there will be a penalty going out to Kingston. And that is number 25, Logan Rose. 25 seconds left to go here in the third period. Rockville is gonna just try and kill off the time. And it looks like they'll do just that as both teams start heading back. Five seconds left. And that is game, ladies and gentlemen. The final score, nine to six in favor of the Brockville Ballistic. The shot total, 47-41 in favor of the Kingston Kings. I hope you guys enjoyed this broadcast of the lacrosse game. As both teams now line up to shake hands.
We hope you enjoyed this. Have a good night, everybody.